All right, well today what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to make a primitive tripod so you can um, hang a, a pot from it for boiling water or cooking soups, what, what have you, ramen noodles, you know, whatever. <coughs> Excuse me. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go to a tree and find a stick, a green stick that's attached to the tree that comes off in a fork, and then we're going to cut that fork right like that. Okay. Then what we're going to do is we're going to start stressing that limb and twisting while we're doing that. And what that does is loosens the fiber up. You know, we can even bend it a little bit. Just we're loosening those fibers up as much as we can. Obviously, you see I've already done it to this one. <laughs> and then what that's for is we're actually going to make this into kind of cordage almost. And that's what we're going to tie our tripod up for. So I'm going to get these three sticks together. And we'll show you how to lash that together and show you how to use it. All right, so we got three fairly straight sticks. And what we're going to do is we're going to arrange them pretty much how we want them. that'll work I guess and then what we're going to use our stick for here it's been a long time since I've heard this I think they're called it this is called a wooby stick or something like that I can't remember exactly and we're going to use that like I said as a cordage to tie our tripod together Just a basic knot will do. It's just holding everything together for us. And then when all that's together, we're going to take this end right here and we're going to actually put it through the middle of all of it and kind of cinch down. One, that tightens everything up, and two, that leaves our forked end hanging down here, and I'll show you what that's for here in a minute once I get it set up. <coughs> so, with our forked end right here, we can actually hang our pots or anything like that from it, and that can dangle over the fire. And the good thing about a tripod like this is, no matter how the fire is coming, you can always raise, raise your pot up, or you can lower it. You know, you can make adjustments with this tripod to wherever you need it to be, up or down. And then you can boil water. Like I said, you can make uh, stews and soups and stuff like that. Um, but having your having your pot above your flames of your fire, the hottest part of your fire is actually several is, is less than an inch above the flames actually it's not in the coal I mean that's obviously really really hot but you're gonna boil water faster if you have your pot raised above the flames just slightly so this is really good for doing that too plus <coughs> excuse me you're not gonna have the pot actually in the fire so there's advantages over that too plus all you need to do is grab your stick like this to get it out of the fire and then you can grab another stick to get your pot off so it might be a little bit safer to cook that way as well. But this has been William from Paramount 101. Thanks for watching. So here's uh, the finished product of the primitive tripod. Will's boiling his water. And you can see why that uh, those fish mouth spreaders are just like the greatest thing anyone ever figured out. <laughs> 